what's going on everybody jake the happy snake here and welcome back to jake wants to be a millionaire yesterday was really annoying because i made it to the 250 000 pound question with two lifelines left i still have the 50 50 and the phone a friend and i phoned a friend first they had no idea so then i used the 50 50 i guessed that one and of course i picked the wrong one so yeah it was really annoying so both lifelines did not help me, which I guess I can't really complain about because the phone a friend single-handedly won me the million pounds on Thursday, so whatever. So I won 32,000 pounds for the second straight episode, and that was converted to $32,000, and that brought my overall total to $65,573,942. So hopefully today is going to go a little bit different. Here we go. Here is today's 100-pound question. Which of these is an American military decoration? That would be Purple Heart. And 100 pounds. Alright, for 200 pounds, which fictional adventurer traveled around the world in 80 days? Uh, that would be Phileas Fogg. Alright, 200 pounds. Here we go for 300. Which of these is not one of the seven colors of the spectrum? Ray. All right. Now going for 500 pounds. Starting in London, in which town does the annual veteran car run finish? I think it's this one. Okay, good. Brighton is the right answer there. And now we're going for 1,000 pounds. Here we go. <clears throat> Which of these is a town on the uh, Leyen Peninsula in Northwest Wales? Okay, I wouldn't have remembered this if it hadn't been for the spelling of these. Aber Sandal, Aber Shoe, Aber Trainer, Aber Sock. Sock, Aber, D is the only one, like they're all named after something to do with like footwear, I think. Uh, but Sock, this one is the only one where Sock is actually not spelled the way it's normally spelled, which is uh, S-O-C-K. Um, so... I'm going, yeah, I'm going to say D. Perfect. There were two questions in there that were like that, because there was the one about, about uh, Alias Fog, or Phileas Fog, or whatever. Uh, and Fog was spelled with two Gs. So there we go. 1,000 pounds guaranteed. All three lifelines are intact. This is the first time since Thursday, actually, that I got through the first five without having to use a lifeline, so that's good, I guess. Here we go for 2,000 pounds. Never Tickle Sleeping Dragon is the motto to which fictional school. Probably Hogwarts. No, I'm not confident. But I'm just, but I'm gonna go with it anyways because I don't feel like getting this wrong. Okay, good. I don't feel like getting this wrong. I easily could have gotten that wrong. Oh man. Okay, two thousand pounds. Now we're going for four thousand with all three lifelines. In the rugby league, if Leeds are in the Rhinos, what are Bradford? The animals sound so right to me right now. Hmm. I'm gonna hate myself if it if it does end up being the animals. I really don't want to get this wrong with all three lifelines still intact. I'm just gonna go with C, because I don't want to use a lifeline. Oh my gosh, why did I do that? <clears throat> I should have asked the audience. That's what I should have done. I was going to 50-50. Gosh, man. I'm so stupid. I shouldn't have done that. Okay. 1,000 pounds is what I win today. That is converted to $1,000, and that brings my overall total to $65,574,942. Thanks all for watching. I appreciate it, and I will see you all back here tomorrow. Peace out.